Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is not going to be a reading, but I wanted to come on here and speak on some things that has been going on in the comment section of one of my videos. Let me start off by saying that I am not a liar. I value positive and negative comments, but you're not about to come on here and discredit me or attack any of my subbies in the comment section that stand up for me. If you have a problem with what I speak on, do us both a favor and don't watch my videos. It's just as simple as that. There are so many awesome intuitive readers out here that you can look at. You have Renee Reads, who is the top dog of them all. Miss Sam, Three Hoodoo Sisters, Wisdom and Light, Ray, Blue Nola, Tracy Brown, and that's how I learned to row is by taking Tracy Brown class. She's also an awesome teacher as well. Eagles, True Chakra Tarot Talk. She mainly do true crime readings, but she's excellent, guys. Tarot Chick, she's out here doing her thing. And one reader I just recently learned about, Lexi at One True Tarot TV. There are so many brothers and sisters out here that readings have come to pass that you can watch. You don't have to watch my channel. Don't leave no stupid ass comments talking about. Read the Bible. There's no such thing as good spirits to help you read Tarot. Get out of the cult. I'm trying to help you. You are being deceived and deceiving others. Go back to Jesus. You sound so stupid. Because one thing I know about, and that's my culture, is spirituality. Spirituality that was once forbidden to practice. My whole world changed for the good ever since I found spirituality. And that's no offense at all to any Christians. Honoring and communicate with my ancestors has been the most profound journey into healing for myself. I'm going to tell you guys the story. My husband transitioned in 2005. And I was far from resolved on many things with him. There was a mixture of deep love, grief, sadness, confusion. And many unanswered questions. I found myself searching for inner peace and started researching about spirituality and found out a lot of things I was raised up on was just so wrong. Tarot as well as Voodoo have such a negative stigma attached to it. People quick to say, it's worshiping the devil. The devil. L-I-V-E-D spelled backwards. But that's a whole different topic. It's witchcraft. And it's not. I had to dissolve that old programming out of my life. Tarot communication and healing has been the most powerful and rewarding gift of my spirituality journey. People have a different standpoint when they find themselves in a situation for instance, their significant other is cheating on them and they want to know. Or they're desperate to find out if they'll get the job that they've been wanting, if they get the job that they applied for, that they truly want. They'll be quick to turn to a reader to get those questions answered. I don't ask you guys for nothing but to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. <laughs> But if you do want to be generous, however, give a donation. My Cash App cash tag can be found in the About Me section. Any donations will be put right back into making this channel better for us. Because we are growing. We're going to grow this channel together. I do need a new camera and a tripod. And some new cards. <laughs> But like I said, I don't ask you guys for nothing. 
I'm truly appreciative to those that do watch me, to those that tell me you're a good reader. That means a lot to me, and I thank you guys for that. But for those that don't like my style and feel like I'm communicating with bad spirits, it costs you nothing to skip over my video. Recuperate the same level of energy, affection, respect, and attention. Good day, guys.